Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission has begun verification of signatures collected for the dis dissolution of Taitatabeta County. Speaking after meeting officials from the office of the president, IEBC boss Wafula Chebukati said the petition will require at least, get this, 15,500 signatures to proceed to the next stage. Let's get more from our very own Stephen Leto. The push to dissolve Taitata Veta County has been gaining momentum, especially after the failed impeachment attempt against Governor Granton Samboja. President Uhuru Kenyatta, already aware of the petition and accompanying signatures, has tasked the IEBC with verification. His Excellency the President has received a petition from voters in Taitata Veta County with a request to suspend the county government. We are here to present the signatures and the names of the petitioners to the IEBC. Upon receipt of the documents, the commission will proceed to do verification. Uh, we shall take a total of five days according to what the team has advised us. Uh, of course, subject to availability of resources. And uh, thereafter, we shall uh, hand over the documents back to, uh, to the Office of the President together with the report. There are 155,000 voters in Taita Taveta, with the law requiring signatures from at least 10% of the total voters, translating to 10,500 signatures for the petition to gain life to the next stage. The Commission has a depositor of the voters' role. We don't have signatures of the voters. And so what we shall be doing is checking the, the names and the information given to us, whether they exist in our voters' register. And this must be voters of Taita Taveta. If the IABC verifies the requisite signatures, the president will within 14 days submit a report on grounds to suspend the county to the apex intergovernmental body. Upon approval from the apex body, the president shall appoint a commission to inquire into the matter and approve by the Senate. The report from the commission shall be forwarded to the president, who then takes the report to the speaker of the Senate, who initiates a motion of suspension of the county government. Governor Samboja last week survived an impeachment attempt by the county assembly after senators found insufficient grounds in the allegations tabled. Various attempts at mediation have also failed since revelations of bad blood between Samboja and the county assembly came to the fore. The political quagmire that has stirred bad blood between MCAs and Taita Taveta Governor Granton Samboja has dragged itself to the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission that now has five days to verify signatures collected that will determine dissolution of Taita Taveta. Stephen Leto, Citizen TV, Nairobi.